Hello writers! So we're going to start our workshop here in about four or five days, but I have a quick little orientation for you before we get started so we can hit the ground running. And that is, um, I want to show you how to post your introduction in the Google communities so that we can all get to know each other on Monday and then get right to work. Uh, this is also a way to kind of sidestep any of the awkwardness you may feel um, or intimidation about working with the Google communities. I know I always feel whenever I start online things a little uh, overwhelmed by, by what's in front of me to do. So hopefully this will um, take a, help you take a chunk, a bite out of the workshop and then get everything started. So this is what I'd like for you to do. Um, by midnight on Monday, I would like for you to um, have posted an introduction and a picture of yourself. So let me show you how to do that. I have created the online um, community. I will send you an invitation to it. Accept the invitation and then you'll get to it through your Google account. So once you get into your Google account, uh, you will go up to the Rubik's Cube, click on that, click on Google Plus, go over to Home, click on Communities, and all of your communities will pop up. I have three because I have uh, three workshops that I lead for the blank page workshops. This one is Basics of Extraordinary Writing, which is the one you are in. Um, and then from there, you'll see along the side, here's the welcome, hello, welcome to the community. On the left-hand side, you'll see um, I have threaded the discussions for each week. Uh, everything that we post will appear on your home page, but it can get kind of jumbled and crazy. And so by creating these threads, we can sort of streamline exactly what we're talking about week to week. So uh, you're going to click on introductions and it will bring up all the introductions and it's in this place that I'd like for you to post your picture. And the reason why I ask that you add a picture is because when we're dealing with an online community it can feel kind of abstract and hard to connect um, unless we help make each other tangible. And so adding the picture gives us sort of a concrete anchor to tie the writing to, especially as we're giving feedback and receiving feedback from one another. So you do that by clicking on photos and then from there you can upload a picture and then once you click share it'll let you write something in uh, the caption and what I'd ask for you to write is the answer to this question um, tell us about your journey with writing until this point. And I have done that for you over here. You can see I write a little bit about my journey with writing and how I came to start the blank page workshops. Um, and I look forward to learning about you and your writing journey. Um, and I look forward to meeting you all here in the workshop. So I hope that answers some major questions and helps make this feel a little bit accessible for you. So um, yes, that's your work between now and Monday. And on Monday, I will have uh, in the Google communities loaded uh, the lecturette and the writing prompt for week one. I look forward to joining you on your writing journey. See you, ladies. Bye.